Hello, I'm Y260, and welcome to 90 Seconds or Less, the series in which I explain how to use the weapons of Modern Warfare 3 in 90 seconds or less. In this episode, I'll be covering the strikingly powerful USAS-12. It's a shotgun, and it features a favorable mix of power and sustainability. In fact, the USAS-12 is almost as powerful as the pump-action shotguns, and because the weapon is fully automatic, it can maintain a competitive rate of fire. Also, the USAS-12 is unique in that while the weapon is equipped, you will be able to run approximately 85% further. So, the extreme conditioning perk is not a necessity with this weapon. However, like all shotguns, the USAS-12 is only effective at close range. Trying to engage an enemy at medium to long range will probably get you killed. Still, when employed correctly, the USAS-12 is remarkably powerful. It is without a doubt the best shotgun for engaging multiple enemies at close range. Sure, it isn't as powerful as the pump action shotguns, but its rate of fire is much higher. In the time it would take a manual shotgun to kill one enemy, the USAS-12 could have killed two, and two kills are always better than one. There are a variety of attachments and proficiencies available for the USAS-12, but these are my recommendations. For our attachment, extended magazines is the most sensible option. The USAS-12 has a relatively slow reload, so increasing your longevity between reloads is a good idea. As for weapon proficiency, I'd recommend damage. With this, you'll acquire a 40% increase in pellet damage. This means that you can expect to see a more consistent one-shot kill at close range. Alternatively, if you're looking for a weapon that will perform well at middle range, you could equip the range proficiency. But bear in mind that you will be less lethal in close quarter situations. Overall, the USAS-12 is a solid shotgun. Although it is not effective at longer ranges, it is relentlessly powerful up close. And with the introduction of close quarter game types such as face-off, the demand for a dependable shotgun has never been higher. So take some time to get a feel for the USAS-12. It might just help you become the king of close quarter combat. This concludes the ninth episode of 90 Seconds or Less. If you would like to be notified of when I have produced the next episode in this series, you can subscribe. Also, if you'd like to see a particular weapon featured in the future, then leave a comment below. But for now, this is Y260, checking out.